I have a blank spot on the wall and I feel like it needs a clock. I want to make it big and colorful and unique, and I want to use upcycled materials. For some of them anyway. And I want to make it seven segment display style, just like in Back to the Future. NeoPixels. NeoPixels are individually controlled LEDs. So I have this strip, I'm gonna cut it into three LED sections and use that as segments for the entire clock. I wrote some code to control the entire thing from a Raspberry Pi Zero. Gotta get some wood and cut it on the CNC machine. Okay, so here's the plan. I routed out two pieces of wood. One's gonna be the back where the, all the LEDs are gonna go, and then there's gonna be a front piece where I'm gonna take all that crushed glass and stuff it in a bunch of holes to make the seven segment displays. But first, I'm gonna paint it. lay my strip of LEDs down in these little grooves on this board. Order is important here because that's how all the LEDs are controlled. So I gotta make sure I put them in the exact order that I coded for. the LEDs are wired up, Raspberry Pi has all the codes, it's time for a test. I've got my two-part epoxy. I'm going to take all that broken glass, put it in the holes of the seven segment display board, and epoxy it in. So I got all my glass clean, but I did make a mistake. I should have taken the labels off before breaking it. Idiot. But no problem, it's ready to go. Gonna epoxy it in the holes now. Pretty happy with the way the clock turned out. So the clock has a couple features. The color of the clock corresponds to the day in the month. So earlier in the month it's more blue, later in the month it's more red. Also, I added one more feature. Alexa, set timer for 30 seconds. 30 seconds, starting now.
timer is set, it starts blue, and then it goes orange at 10 seconds, and then red at 5 seconds. This one was a fun one to make. I hope you enjoyed watching it. If you like projects like these, please consider subscribing, and even hit that bell to be alerted when a new video comes up. I always like to have the opportunity to find something old and make it into something else, so upcycling this glass was right up my alley. And speaking of upcycling and environment stuff, Team Trees. You might have heard of this. There is a large campaign going on between the YouTube community where we're trying to raise $20 million to plant 20 million trees. Now that sounds like a huge feat, but we have partnered with the Arbor Day Foundation where every dollar donated equals one tree planted. I've donated to plant some trees, and if you'd like to donate, all the links are below, and you can follow all the instructions there, or hit the donate button right on this video. Also, the donations are accepted throughout the end of the year, and all those trees are gonna be planted throughout 2020. Thanks for watching, I'm out of time.